I'm at Moog, and we've got Sarah Lance to talk about the Minotaur. Hi. Minotaur is our latest um, analog bass synthesizer, and it, it carries on the heritage of the original Taurus bass pedals. And uh, following on our reissue of the Taurus with the Taurus 3 um, last year, and um, this is a, designed to be a very small, versatile, um, portable analog bass synthesizer, but with all the great bass and punch and body of the Taurus. And also to really fit really well in kind of modern um, production environments. It's got USB MIDI, DIN MIDI, and um, fully controllable from a MIDI controller. It's also got analog control voltages in, so you could use it in the classic analog synth um, way. But let me give a couple demonstrations. It's two oscillator synth. On the Minotaur, you can control the oscillators individually. So that's oscillator one, can be uh, sawtooth or square. And oscillator two can be sawtooth or square. We can also adjust, you can feel the bass there, my pants are flapping. Um, so now I'm gonna mix the two oscillators together and get some nice, nice beating there. So that classic Moog, Moog ladder filter sound. Now we on the filter section, we have an envelope generator. It's the um, an ADSR en uh, envelope generator. We can have variable attack, and I'll and variable uh, decay and release and sustain amount. Now we can also do a negative envelope. So where we're pulling the frequency out, which gets you some really nice, um, almost get some kind of kick drum sounds out of this thing with a lot of sub bass there. So very flexible, um, not used to having the mic in front of my mouth, <laughs> very flexible um, envelope section. We also have a VCA with the uh, same kind of ADSR. It can get a nice long release, you can have release on. So a real flexible um, envelope section, and also you know classic glide. I got quite a bit of negative envelope. You can have glide on or off. We also have an LFO section. So right now I'm going to add some. You know you can hear some pitch em pitch envelope uh, LFO rate. I also control how much LFO is going to the filter. So that's all filter right there. So a very flexible little synth and um, just a lot of fun. So that's it. We're at Moog checking out the Minotaur. You go check it out too.